Hey there guys, welcome back. Uh, I uh, just got home from uh, just got home from work here a uh, little bit ago, literally like probably ten minutes ago I'd say. So this is a video that probably won't get posted until probably sometime sometime later this morning. So you guys will be seeing this video in. Uh, Hopefully the morning or early afternoon, somewhere in there. But uh, the video I wanted to do today, I wanted to discuss, because I got a couple of these, and uh, just a couple of things that I wanted to discuss about jerseys and stuff that uh, sometimes, you know, you go... You look on some sites, you'll see, you know, you'll see different jerseys and you're like, oh, wow, that's a pretty good, you know, that's a, that's a really good deal. You know, I can get, oh, wow, I can get this authentic jersey for like 40 bucks or, you know, 30 bucks. Problem is, you see some of those, you see, you see an authentic, whether it was an authentic Reebok or an authentic Adidas for 30 40 bucks it's fake it's a fake now now some people like the fakes because you know because they, they they're not you know they're they're not expensive you know they're hey you know i'll i'll wear i'll wear this this you know i'll wear this 30 40 dollar jersey nobody can you know nobody's really gonna tell you know, if it's the real deal or not. Anybody who wears or collects hockey jerseys will know what a fake looks like. I have been to I have been to Minnesota Wild Games. I have seen the fakes, and oh, I to say they're an eyesore is just. Ugh just they're just they're, they're the quality the the colors are are so far off it's just it's not it's not even close and i have and i actually have a couple obviously i don't wear them but uh i figured i would show you here's one this is a minnesota wild jersey from a few a few years ago you can tell it was a few years ago. It's got Brent Burns on the back. However, it is it is fake as fake can be. As you can tell, this is I mean in, in comparison to here's what the real Reebok one looks like. The real now this is a replica. Uh, this is a replica, but Look at the difference. I mean, you can kind of see the, I mean, the collar is different. I mean, I mean, look at the NHL logo on here in comparison to here. I mean, it's not, you know, it's not, it's not even close. And like I said, this is a replica. So, I mean, it's a little, it's obviously a little bit different, but of course this is, you know, Parisi on the back, but they say, you know, it's got the, it's got the Reebok logos on it, but it's just, I mean, the quality, I mean, and look at the, look at the, look at the stripe, look at the, the, the cream stripe there in comparison. I mean, I mean, really? <laughs> I mean, can, can you get, you know, I mean, can you really get much, much closer of uh, just, of just awfulness? And this one. And this was like this on the on the authentic ones too. This is felt. This is a felt logo, as you can tell. Yeah, you show it show it into the light there. It's all felt. It's very it's you know it's very very decent very decent quality, you know. But it's that's that's all felt. Where this one, is not. This is just. 
you know, it's it's not it's not even close. And even the wild logo is not even close. I mean, when you go and when you go and you compare the two side by side next to each other, I mean, it's just it is. It's not even it's not even it's not even close. There, let me take this off real quick here and kind of get a little better better of a view maybe side by side here but but again I mean you know you've got you've got this in comparison to this I mean it's again it's not it's not even it's not even close I mean and, and which one do you think looks better I mean honestly this one looks looks way better and look at the coloring. The color is not even, I mean, the green does not even match on this one in comparison to this one. It's just, it's just, it's shoddy. It's just very, very shoddy. And, and it's just, it's not, not good. And I mean, even the collar, even the collar. I mean, look at the collar here. You got this nice ribbed collar here. You don't have that here. And of course, this is, you know, this is all stained and everything. And it just, that's, and then even the back. Let's look at, look at the, look at the customization on the back. Look at the burns. Again, you know, it's just, it's, it's very shoddy. It's very shoddy. The customization, it's not, it's, again, it's not even close. And again, one other way you can tell let's see if this has it on the inside here yeah i mean seriously i mean come on that's horrible <laughs> that is some of the most horrible absolute crap that i've ever really seen and it's the same on i believe it's the same on the numbers on the back it's the same on the back. You've got this this awful backing or whatever. It's just it's it's horrible. And you go and you look at those numbers and that name compared to this. Now of course this is my Zach Parisi jersey. This is how they should look. I mean let's go back. You know we kind of show back here get a little bit of a uh side by side again let's put this back on that might help a little bit with the uh, being able to see the back but again you know you got the numbers here that's the real that's the real deal i actually had though i actually had those put on this jersey at the hockey lodge at the xl center in comparison to this i mean yeah, it's not even it's not even close. Not even close. So that's one example of now th these were Reeboks. One big example of a fake Reebok in comparison to a real one. Now again, mind you, this is a replica. This is a quote authentic. No, not not even not even close. And these ones, I I yeah, I just just throw them down. They just, that's, that's the quality they are. They're just garbage. Absolute garbage. <clears throat> now this one, this one here, this is an Adidas one. Sorry there guys, stuff falling down here. This is an Adidas one. Now, <laughs> this is a, fa I mean, this is a, fa it's, it's bad. I mean, it's a bad, you know, it, it's an, it's an attempt, but it's a bad attempt. I mean, you know, you've got the Adidas, I mean, this, you got the Adidas logo actually, you know, sewn through there. That's not really like that. The Vegas is just completely wrong. Of course, the NHL shield looks nothing like, you know, looks absolutely nothing like, like it should. But they certainly tried. They certainly tried because this was supposed to be from the first year. 
There's that button. Now, and of course, the, you know, you got the shoulder logo here. This is a really, really bright, I mean, this is a, a very sparkly, very sparkly kind of gold. And, I mean, you can tell, you can tell it's a fake just by looking at it. Now, here's the real one. This is the authentic from Adidas. I mean, you know, back up a little bit. It's just, this is way better. And even here, look on the sleeve. Here's the sleeve. In comparison, this is the fake. You know, this is a, you know, supposed to be a, a James Neal uh, from the first year. But, uh, yeah, it's just, it's not, it's not even close. It's just, the, the quality is just, is just awful again. Now, again, on the fakes, you have, you have that. Not good. And people are, and people are getting these, you know, people can get these for like 30, you know, 30, $35. And some people don't mind it. They really don't. And of course, you know, you got the, the, the inside there. They tried to make that look a little better, but I mean, look at the strings are just, I mean, the, the strings are just, yeah. The strings are just fraying all over the place. It's just, it's just horrible. And again, you look at the Adidas on the inside, on the, you know, I mean, let's look. You got the Adidas there inside the neckline. Do you see that on the inside here? Nope. Look at the NHL logos, the NHL shield here. In comparison to, you know, look at the two. I mean, again, <clears throat> it's not even close. Now, again, they get they're getting better. They are getting better in trying to get this, the NHL shield. It's still not there, but boy, they're trying. They are they're they're really trying to get close. And again, you know this this has, you know, I mean you got the shiny you got the shiny gold here, but it's it's the right it's the right one. And again, I mean in comparison. You know, it's, and they, and again, they try, they try their, they, they try their damnedest to get this to look, you know, as, as authentic and as close as they can. But again, it's not even close. Even the neck, even, even the neckline is, is wrong. I mean, look at the neckline there in comparison to that. Again, not even close. Just, just shoddy, just shoddy work. But again, they try, they try their damnedest to get it to, to get it to look as authentic as they can. I mean, they come, they got the tags. I mean, they, they come with, they come with the tags here, you know, to make it look, to make it look legit. You know, the NHL PA tag. And they even have, they even have the hologram tag here. That, you know, that changes from NHL to LNH. You know, and you can't really see it in the in the light here, but but you know, you give them an A for effort. They try, but I mean, even the gold. I mean, even the gold. It just it's it's not it's not good. It just it's not. So obviously, you know, buyer beware. On the type of on you know the type of jersey you're getting. Oh, and another thing. Let's show this. There's the secondary logo on the fake. And there's the secondary logo on the real one. Now this has the shiny, has that shiny sparkly gold, while this one does not. This and this one is made so much better than this one, but again, they try, they try their damnedest. But uh, 
But again, you know, it's just one of those things, you know, buyer, buyer beware. The, you know, because the colors are not, you know, the colors are off on, on the, the, the fake ones. The colors are always wrong. And, and it's always funny when people go and tell me, oh no, that's a real jersey. No, that's, that's a true authentic. You know, that's, that's the, that's the real deal. And I just look at them and I'm just like, <laughs> okay, <laughs> then, you know, you, you, you think, you think whatever you want. Not good. I mean, and, and, you know, a collector like me, I, I, I'm, I'm one that can, that I can spot those, I can spot those things from across the room. I mean, especially, especially the wild ones. When they try to make the fake Minnesota wild ones, oh, just awful. Awful, awful, awful. So, so, yeah. So when you're, when you're looking around and you're looking at jerseys and you're trying to find a good place to buy hockey jerseys and you find a site, you know, a lot of times they're, they're from China, they're from Russia, they're, they're nowhere close. And it might take, you know, you might, you might, you might wait four to six months for this jersey to show up and you're going to find out it's coming from China or it's coming from Russia. It's just, you know, you got to stay away from a lot of those sites, you know, especially, you know, eBay, eBay's got a lot of those sites. These, these sites that just, they just pop up out of nowhere some, sometimes and they're, you know, yeah, hundred percent authentic, you know, hundred percent authentic Adidas jerseys or authentic Reebok jerseys for thirty-five dollars. They're not real. They are fake as fake can be. And why would you want to spend thirty, thirty-five dollars on a jersey like that when honestly, and I've I've done this, I got a Reebok jersey. It was right before the changeover to Adidas. I found a Reebok uh, Montreal Canadiens jersey. Yeah, let me see if I can find that one. Okay, this one. I got this. I got this jersey. I had had the one with the different neckline on it. I got this jersey right before the changeover. I got this from an eBay seller. He had pictures, everything on there. When you'll spend 40, 35, 40, 50 dollars on those fakes, I got this one. This is the real deal, obviously. You know, it's me being a bigger dude. It's a 4XL. But this is this is an this is a a true Reebok Premier. I got this for 50 bucks. 50 dollars. So you know why would why would you want to go with an authentic, a quote authentic that you know is like 40, 50 bucks when it's horrible quality, and you can get a jersey like that for the same price if you find it on a deal, and most of the time there are sites out there where you don't have to pay full price for them in the first place. You know, a lot of places that I that that I've gone through. Are, couple of a couple of the main places that I go through you can get these jerseys for for 50 60 70 almost you know anywhere from between 50 to 75 dollars off the normal price so I mean why would you why would you do that I don't know why you would get a uh, why you would want to mess around and get a fake when you can get the real deal for sometimes the same price, you know, it just always depends on where you're, where you're looking, but you gotta, you gotta go through the reputable, the reputable sites if you're going to do that. But yeah, just, I couldn't do the fakes. I've, I've got a couple of them. Obviously I don't wear them. They're, they're a good, they're, they're a good reminder, a good buyer beware kind of thing. If you find a, if you find a, you find a, as they say, a 100% authentic Adidas 
or Reebok jersey for 40, 45, 50 bucks. Pretty sure 99% of the time it's going to be a fake. So I just wanted to kind of do a, do a little comparison right there. And, uh, you know, that's, that's kind of my, uh, my little, uh, soapbox thing. You know, I've just being, being a collector, I just, I, I hate seeing, seeing the fakes out there. They're just, they're, they just, they look, they look awful. And I just, I can't, uh, fake jerseys are just, eh, they're, they're very, they're very cringe for me at least. But, uh, but yeah, that was my little, little, uh, little comparison of real, real, real jerseys to the fake ones. And, uh, you know, and I, fi I figured I'd tell you, you know, there's, there's a couple other ideas for, uh, for videos that I want to, that I want to do. Uh, a couple other, couple other countdown, countdown style videos I'm looking to do. Uh, one of them is I am looking to go through my, my vintage, my vintage CCM collection and do a countdown of those. And, uh. And then I think it's uh, at some point, especially now that now that I have uh, I have Seattle, you know, I'll have to look through a lot of these, and maybe I'll do uh, I'll I'll do a countdown of my entire collection at some point. But I think the first one I'll do is uh, I think I might go through a lot of my CCMs and try to fi try to figure out what uh, you know try to figure out a little countdown there from you know. I mean, obviously I like them all. Just you know, trying to trying to rank them all. I don't even know how many I have. I gotta go through and count them. But but uh, that's kind of the uh, that that's kind of the that's kind of the idea for uh, you know for future videos. So I uh, I hope you guys uh, have had a have had a good uh, good evening here. Hopefully. You know, if you if you if you watch this and you get through the end, you know, hopefully you kind of know a little bit of uh, what not what not to look for. Obviously, if you're looking on eBay or whatever, if they have just the stock photos, the the stock generic photos like you would see on the NHL shop site, and they have it on their site, mm, that's kind of a red flag. You want to see photos, you want to see close-up photos, you want to see the real deal. More than just one photo, you want to see, you know, up close, all that. So, it's just, you know, you got you to kind of know, kind of got to know what you're, got to got to know what you're looking for. And, you know, like I said, some people don't mind the fakes. I, I can't, I can't do them. You know, especially when you can get the real deal for sometimes the same price. I mean, I've gotten a couple for, you know, the same price as you'd buy a fake. I've gotten the real deal. So, it just depends on what you're looking for. But, uh, but yeah, that will, uh, that will, that will do it for me. Uh, hopefully you guys, uh, you know, might all, you know, if you've, if you've never, if you've never really come across a fake before, I gotta think a lot of a lot of you know a lot of you guys have have come across fakes before, but I figured I'd do that little comparison. And uh, you know, if uh, you know if there's anybody new that just uh, happens to maybe click on this video and you know enjoy it, hopefully you can get all the way to the end. And uh, you know, hopefully you like the video. Hit the subscribe button. I would love to have you. I'd love to have you be here. And uh, yeah, it's just a. Uh, a pretty good time so you know hit hit like and subscribe i would love to have you be a part of the channel i'd love to see uh like to see how this channel can grow you know it's it's done it's done pretty it's done pretty well uh pretty well lately i'd like to see i'd like to see it keep going and uh i would uh love your guys's help with that so uh again hit like and subscribe if you're just cruising on through and you just happen to come across one of my videos or one of my other videos on the channel hopefully you like it hit like and subscribe and uh i will talk to you guys again real soon